What's inside your pimples? Let's zoom in because if you take a closer look, you'll see that every pore on your skin is a part of something called the pilosebaceous unit. That includes a hair follicle and an oil producing gland called the sebaceous gland. This gland makes sebum, an oily substance that keeps skin moisturized. But here's where things go sideways. Sometimes skin cells don't shed properly. They clump together with sebum and plug the follicle. Now enter the bacteria, Cutibacterium acnes. Normally, they just hang out on your skin, no beef. But when trapped in a clogged pore, it finds a perfect low oxygen buffet and starts multiplying. Your immune system sees this happening and hits the red alert. White blood cells rush in to fight the bacteria. That leads to inflammation, redness, swelling, tenderness, and boom, a pimple is born. The yellow stuff inside? A mix of dead skin, sebum, bacteria, and immune cells. Tempted to pop it? Don't. That could push the gunk deeper, causing more inflammation and even scarring. So if you want fewer breakouts, focus on things that unclog pores, balance oil, and calms inflammation.